was good. Mm. Yeah, it was. Well, that didn't sound too convincing. I'm not the rose, but I've been doing a little thing you asked me to do, right? Mm -hmm. No, it's not that. You're fine. I mean, I know I've been sticking to the routine, but I got a few more tricks in my sleeve. Whatever. You're, you're fine. Just stop. Okay, so what is it then? I've just been thinking. About? Life. Hey, and what about life? Us. And what about us? <laughs> like we have this nice apartment, good paying jobs, we're healthy. What are you thinking about? I don't think we're meant to be together. This isn't coming out of nowhere. I just, I've been thinking a lot about it ever since Nana died. Okay, uh, what does your dead grandma have to do with this? You know how much she was spiritual and how much we spoke about astrology. Yeah, but what does that have to do with us? You're a Cancer. I'm an Aries. Fire, water, complete opposites. Plus, ever since she known you, she thought you would extinguish my fire. And I am honestly starting to feel that way too. Now I know she didn't just say because I'm a Cancer. I'm about to delete Janae Aiko's whole catalog out of her Spotify. Well, say something. So what? You gonna leave me for a fire sign? No. You need a sag in your life? That's what it is? See, no. I know you wouldn't take it serious. We're young. And I'm free-spirited by nature. And I feel like you're holding me back from my true purpose. And this is not what I really wanted for my life. You know this. I don't want you to kill that fire that I have inside of me, you know? I feel like if I settle, I'm going to regret that. Got it. So, I mean, I guess you've made up your mind already, you know? Yeah. I'm sorry, but I'm going to go stay at a friend's, and um, I'll let you know when I come back for the rest of my stuff, okay? Hey, I'm gonna need you half of the rent still. We got three months left on this lease. Cause I keep looking at the clock on my phone, watching the time. Are you in love with someone else? Are you in love with me? Do you need something else to go in and let you free? Should I know exactly what do you mean to me? Do you know exactly what you do mean to me? I can't get you out of my head I can't get you out of my head I want you in my bed But this pillow gon' do Guess this pillow gon' do Guess this pillow gon' do The lonely Happy birthday. birthday! Well, I got let us out of this room. Come on. Yeah, come on. <sighs> yeah, thank you, buddy. Let me get, let me get this light on for y'all. Hold on, sorry, sorry. <sighs> Dog, I'm not gonna lie, I smell like eighth grade ass in here. I'm picking up uh, vanilla. Nah, Bree, that's the cake. So you ain't got no uh, ass on that tonight, huh? That's that's a valid question. It's his birthday, isn't it? I just plan on turning 27 here in peace. You feel me? <laughs> Such a cancer. You love being alone. What do the stars got to do with my boy getting some ass? I mean, Reggie, look at him. 
he's in his shell and no offense but he's been thinking about that girl longer than he should I'm saying it adds up all niggas do that bro if anything that just mean that the net it was fine Listen, all I'm saying is that, I don't know, you should look into it. You could figure out who you are, why you are the way you are, and, you know, it could probably help you in future relationships. But what do I know? Yeah, uh, what do you know? Look, y'all, I gotta get out of here. So, um, let's go cut this cake. Gotta get some extra cream for the wifey. Scratch that boogie with it. Let's do it. Come on. Seems like everybody doing what everybody do. Chilling with they doing nothing friends like they still in high school. Ain't no room for no else, but we got a room where you can snooze. I just like when they sleeping on the nigga. Probably the best thing they can do. Okay, we rocking, my boy. Happy birthday, man. Be safe, all right? Thank you. You already. Hey, but I'm serious. You should test it out. It can't really hurt, so. Yeah, I'll see what's up. No promises, though. Alright. Happy birthday. Yeah, also give me one more second. I am in a parking lot. It's really creepy right now, so I'm just trying to rush to my car. So give me a second. <laughs> Motherfucker! Oh. <sighs> yeah, my bad. What was I saying? So you do know what determines the sex of an alligator, right? <laughs> Why would I know that? I don't know, because we learned it in high school. Listen, I've been out of school for 10 years, Bree. I actually try to forget what happened back then. Well, the water temperature at which the alligators conceived determines the sex of the baby. Why are we talking about alligator sex again? Can you just forget about alligators for five seconds, please? <laughs> you brought it up. It's just proving my point that our environments have a connection to our behaviors. Like if a silly little thing like the water temperature affects an alligator's whole DNA, it'd be crazy to rule out the sun, the moon, the stars and its alignment and its effect on us. I ain't gonna lie, Bree, that sounds kind of crazy. All right, listen, I'm sending you a link right now. Check it out, please. Uh, got it. All right, cool. Now click it, figure out what's wrong with you and go heal, please. Okay, but I feel like that's what therapy was supposed to do, you know? Is that Reggie? So, Bri, I'm gonna call you back. Wait, you please. Back. Okay, okay. One second. Oh. Hey, man, get your girl. My girl, who? Bri, yo, she preaching the moon and star shit again. I don't know. You know, she needs you to believe in that shit. <laughs> Why don't she anymore? Well, because it says we're supposed to be together, but now we're not together. I don't understand how she expects for us to be together when the world is not forever. So every time we think about forever, it's not together. You hear what I'm saying? Other words, I can't stand her, bro. She blow my shit. <laughs> I mean, that just sound like marriage, bro. Yeah. I, I wish I had what you had. Shut the fuck up. Shut up, JR. My bad. You do not wish that. I'm going to tell you one thing, though. Remember Shanice Homegirl? You know, the one with the uh, and the big of the uh, and the big of the uh. I think so, yeah. Yeah, she done with that scheming nigga, but now she wanna fuck with you, so you might have to, you oh, know. Oh, shit. Yeah. Like, fuck with me how, though? Like, you think I'm fire, or, like, she just wanna know how I feel like I'm depressed? Bro, you overthinking it. Okay. When I throw you the alley, just dunk it. That's my, all you gotta do. My, my, you know my, what I'm my, saying? My. Yeah. Hit her up and take it from there. Got so, it. look, this is what I'm gonna do now. Okay. I'm gonna dip, <laughs> okay? okay? I'm gonna dip. I gotta pick this bitch up from the train station, so I'm gonna holla at you, all right? Huh? Huh, babe? Wait, hold on, what bitch? Come on. What's up? What's up? What's up?
DM'd me for coffee. So, you know, I, I don't even like coffee like that. You know what I'm saying? I, I was just like, you know what? Let me try to do a spot I saw that just opened up. And I was like, yo, let's, let's go get some coffee. No, nope, okay. silly. Yeah, I'm saying, like, I always thought you were cute, but I just left it at that. But, you know, I'm happy that you DM'd me. Well, yeah, you know, a little birdie told me you were single now, so Ooh. I had to check it out. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, a little birdie? Ooh, birdie. Tiny little bird. Tiny little bird. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you know what you drink? There's a spot around here I want to show you. I grew up around here, so I want to see if it's still over there. Yeah, let's go. All right, come on. So what else do you have going on this weekend? Uh, I got to sit down with one of my accountants, check on my LLCs, make sure everything's straight. You know? Oh, I didn't know you had your own business. Yeah, I got a few, actually. Who wants to work a nine to five their whole life? Amen to that. Yeah, but then after that, I'm probably going to go to uh, DR. Need a quick little weekend trip, get away. I've been craving some fresh mangoes. Mm -hmm. So i got to go straight to the source. Well, it's already Thursday. That's so spontaneous of you. Where have you been my whole life? <laughs> well, you know, got to keep life interesting while I'm young. What about you, though? Anything planned? I mean, nothing like that, but... Oh, Back my God. Up. Yeah. Tell them to watch it. Now nah, I ain't talking my pockets. Just know we ain't running out the way that we stock it. If I got it, you got it. If I call it, she's <laughs> not and tell her to mock it. Yeah, I got that shit going. Damn, nigga, you guys attacking me so damn hard. You make it look convincing. You have to run that fast. Yeah, yeah, whatever the hell you say, man. Listen, too many damn white people staring at me. Anything else you need from me? I, I'm gonna have to hit you up. You're gonna have to I'm what? Gonna have to you. You're gonna have to. You good. I got you. Are you okay? You know, I'm good. As long as you good, we good. Cash up you later, bro. What did you say? Nothing, nothing. Let's get out of here, though. All right, because that was, like, way too much excitement for me. Yeah, I need to lay down or something. Let's get you home. What and I'm crashing in. Hundreds on hundreds, I'm moving and grooving. She wanna cut up, I'ma slash again. Buckets on buckets, I'm switching edition. Back in my bag, going back again. Oh, I feel like a lad and yeah, I'm on a carpet, flying through orbits, ain't doing no talking. Why? Damn, my body as soon as I walk and bitches be stalking.